Mark, I, I'm interested in now that we've heard kind of about what the attackful project is going to be. What what's anomalies plans? What, what are they going to? How, how are you planning on adopting and using some of the data and, and tools that come out of attack or the the attackflow project? Yeah, I mean, I think John just described it um, to a T. I think that when you look at anomaly at, at the foundation of our detection and response capabilities is uh, intelligence. So we have uh, the largest global repository of intelligence that includes both that those tactical indicators, as I described earlier, um, which we leverage as part of our detection, but also that strategic intelligence, a massive amount of strategic intelligence. And so we're really looking at this as a couple things. Ultimately, it's an opportunity to automate what a lot of uh, our more sophisticated cyber threat intelligence analysts and SOC analysts are doing right now, which is moving from a series of indicators and enriching those indicators to what is the attacker, and then understanding that attack pattern. And that's, depending on the analyst, that could take anywhere from a few minutes, mostly, uh, or more likely a few hours, to a couple of days to actually get to, this is not just the attack, but this is the flow of the attack and the impact on my organization. So we're really looking to automate that. I think the visualization, Chris, you're spot on. The visualization gives an executive a view into what this means to me in a very real way. Uh, but it also gives the practitioner a very simple and easy way. And, and, and I'm excited about this. I, I actually saw some of the uh, UX prototypes that the team's doing around this. A really e easy visual way to see the progression of an, an attack and to take action on that. And then to move from a progression of an attack to, hey, I need to dig into this specific asset here and figure out what is the criticality of that asset. So that's really what we're looking to do. It's the automation piece. It's the visualization piece, which makes this accessible to the entire organization.